Greetings, curious humans. I'm Cybot GPT, your guide to all things science, and today, we're about to embark on a mind-bending expedition that will take us back to the very beginning of it all, the Big Bang. Imagine a moment where nothing existed, not even space or time. Then, suddenly, in an inconceivably intense burst of energy, everything we know and observe came into existence. This breathtaking event, known as the Big Bang, marks the birth of our universe as we know it. In this captivating video, we'll delve into the mysteries surrounding the Big Bang Theory, exploring the astounding concepts and groundbreaking discoveries that have shaped our understanding of the cosmos. From the first moments after the explosion to the formation of galaxies, stars, and planets, we'll unravel a scientific narrative that has allowed us to piece together the story of our universe's origin. Join me as we unravel the cosmic web of evidence, theories, and mind-boggling concepts that have propelled humanity's exploration of the universe forward. Whether you're an avid space enthusiast or just starting your journey into the cosmos, get ready to expand your horizons and witness the grandeur of the Big Bang like never before. So, without further ado, let's ignite the engines of curiosity and set forth on a voyage to comprehend the very fabric of our existence. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button and ring the notification bell to stay tuned for this awe-inspiring cosmic adventure. Let's dive into the heart of the Big Bang. The Big Bang Theory explains the expansion of the universe from a high-density, high-temperature state. Different cosmological models detail the evolution of the observable universe, explaining phenomena like light element abundance, cosmic microwave background radiation, and large-scale structure. Cosmic inflation, a rapid space expansion, addresses the flatness problem or the uniformity of the universe. However, there's no widely accepted quantum gravity theory for the Big Bang's earliest conditions. These models are consistent with the hubble Metra law, which states galaxies move faster away from Earth with distance. Extrapolating this backward leads to a singularity, the Big Bang singularity. Discovery of the CMB in 1964 discredited the steady-state model, supporting the Big Bang. Evidence strongly supports this event. Measurements suggest the Big Bang singularity occurred around 13.787 billion years ago, roughly the universe's age. After the initial expansion, cooling allowed subatomic particles and atom formation. Unexplained baryon asymmetry led to matter and antimatter unevenness, allowing formation of primordial elements, leading to stars and galaxies. Dark matter's gravitational effects surround galaxies, exceeding baryonic matter. The universe's expansion accelerates due to unexplained dark energy. The Big Bang models comprehensively explain various observed phenomena, including light element abundances, cosmic microwave background, large scale structure, and Hubble's law. These models are based on the universality of physical laws and the cosmological principle. The universality of physical laws is supported by observations of the fine structure constant and tests of general relativity on different scales. The cosmological principle suggests the universe appears isotropic, uniform in all directions, and homogeneous, same everywhere. The Copernican principle, stating no preferred observer, supports this. Observations of the CMB temperature confirm the cosmological principle to a level of 10 to the minus fifth. On a larger scale, the universe is about 10% inhomogeneous as of 1995. The expansion of the universe is a key component of Big Bang models. General relativity describes space-time with a metric determining distances between points. The friedman lemaitre robertson walker FLRW, metric is chosen due to the cosmological principle, featuring a scale factor describing the universe's changing size over time. Objects moving due to the universe's expansion remain fixed on the expanding grid and commoving coordinates. The Big Bang is not an explosion of matter but an expansion of space itself. Particle horizons are significant in Big Bang spacetime due to finite light speed and universe age. A past horizon limits observation of distant events, while a future horizon depends on the universe's expansion rate. Thermalization in the early universe depended on the ratio of process rate to the Hubble parameter, determining whether processes reached thermodynamic equilibrium or not. According to the Big Bang models, the universe began as a hot and compact state, and it has been expanding and cooling since then. The term Big Bang can refer to both the primordial singularity and a generic early hot phase of the universe. 
the singularity is an irregular gravitational point indicating a limitation of general relativity. The Planck epoch, up to 10 to the power of negative 43 seconds into the expansion, had unification of the four fundamental forces. The universe rapidly expanded during inflation, causing exponential growth and temperature drop. This addressed the flatness problem and produced seeds for large-scale structure. Afterward, the electroweak epoch began, followed by a period of grand unification. Inflation ended, leading to reheating and the production of particles like quarks. A phase transition around 10 to the power of negative 6 seconds saw the formation of protons and neutrons. At about 1 second, electron-positron annihilation occurred. During Big Bang nucleosynthesis, neutrons and protons combined to form deuterium and helium nuclei. The universe cooled, and about 379,000 years in, electrons and nuclei formed atoms, releasing cosmic microwave background radiation. This radiation is a relic of the early universe. Over time, slightly denser regions of uniformly distributed matter attracted nearby matter through gravitational forces, leading to the formation of gas clouds, stars, galaxies, and other astronomical structures. The process's specifics depend on the type and amount of matter in the universe, including cold dark matter and baryonic matter. The Wilkinson Microwave Anisotropy Probe measurements support a Lambda CDM model with cold dark matter comprising about 23% and baryonic matter about 4.6% of the universe's matter slash energy. The universe's current state is influenced by dark energy, an enigmatic energy form that permeates space homogeneously. Approximately 73% of today's energy density is attributed to dark energy. When the universe was young, gravity dominated due to everything being closer, slowing expansion. As time passed and matter density decreased relative to dark energy, the universe's expansion began to accelerate. Dark energy is often modeled with a cosmological constant term in Einstein's field equations of general relativity, yet its composition and mechanism remain unknown. Its equation of state and relationship with the standard model of particle physics are subjects of ongoing study. Post-inflationary cosmic evolution is described by the Lambda CDM model, utilizing quantum mechanics and general relativity. However, understanding the universe's earliest moments, prior to around 10 to the power of negative 15 seconds, remains a significant unsolved challenge in physics. The term Big Bang was coined by Fred Hoyle in a 1949 BBC radio broadcast, referring to the idea that all matter in the universe originated from a single event. Hoyle's intention behind the term being pejorative is disputed. It is a misnomer, as the Big Bang wasn't an explosion but the stretching of space itself. The development of Big Bang models stem from observations and theoretical considerations. Vesto Slipher's Doppler shift measurements of spiral nebulae revealed their recession from Earth, hinting at an expanding universe. Alexander Friedman derived equations indicating an expanding universe, contrasting Albert Einstein's static model. Edwin Hubble's distance indicators, the cosmic distance ladder, and his discovery of the correlation between distance and recessional velocity, Hubble's law, supported expansion. Georges Lemaitre proposed that recession resulted from universal expansion, and he further suggested that the universe's past size converged to a primeval atom. The steady-state theory and various non-standard cosmologies were also proposed. After World War II, Fred Hoyle's steady-state model and Lemaitre's Big Bang theory competed. Observational evidence and the discovery of the cosmic microwave background favored the Big Bang theory. Penrose, Hawking, and Ellis showed that mathematical singularities are inevitable in relativistic models of the Big Bang. In the 1980s, Alan Guth introduced inflation, addressing certain theoretical problems. The 1990s brought advances in telescope technology and data analysis, including COBE, Hubble Space Telescope, and WMAP. Precise measurements and the discovery of cosmic acceleration have contributed to significant progress in Big Bang cosmology. Observational evidence strongly supports the Big Bang theory. Hubble's law, which describes the expansion of the universe through redshift measurements of galaxies, confirms this. Other evidence includes the discovery of the cosmic microwave background and the relative abundances of light elements through Big Bang nucleosynthesis. The cosmic microwave background radiation, discovered in 1964, confirms predictions from the 1950s. The CMB has a blackbody spectrum consistent with the Big Bang's predictions. 
temperature fluctuations in the CMB were detected by COBE in later experiments supporting the Big Bang model. Big Bang nucleosynthesis explains the relative abundances of light elements like helium-4, helium-3, deuterium, and lithium-7. These abundances are calculated based on the baryon to photon ratio and match observed values. This agreement provides strong evidence for the Big Bang theory. While the Big Bang theory is well supported by evidence, there are still open questions and challenges, including dark matter and dark energy, and some inconsistencies in the observed abundances of certain elements. These challenges remain active areas of research and are currently unsolved problems in physics. Detailed observations of galaxies and quasars align with the current state of Big Bang models. The formation of quasars and galaxies within a billion years after the Big Bang is supported by observations and theory. Structures like galaxy clusters and superclusters have formed over time. Stars' populations have evolved, leading to different appearances for distant and nearby galaxies. These observations oppose the steady-state model and agree with simulations of structure formation in the Big Bang theory. The discovery of pristine clouds of primordial gas, devoid of heavy elements, supports the Big Bang nucleosynthesis theory, suggesting these clouds formed just after the Big Bang. Various lines of evidence, such as the age of the universe, cosmic microwave background temperature fluctuations, and observations of distant objects, support the Lambda CDM model. However, some concerns about early quasar formation persist. Challenges and open questions remain in Big Bang cosmology. The asymmetry between matter and antimatter, known as baryon asymmetry, and the nature of dark energy are unsolved mysteries. Dark matter, despite its indirect gravitational effects, remains undetected, prompting alternative theories. The cold dark matter model faces challenges like the dwarf galaxy problem and the cuspy halo problem. These issues are areas of intense research and investigation in cosmology and astrophysics. The horizon problem arises due to the finite speed of light and the uniformity of the cosmic microwave background. In a universe with a finite age, there's a limit on how far regions in causal contact can be. This contradicts the uniformity of the CMB across distant regions. Inflation theory proposes that the universe underwent rapid expansion, allowing causally disconnected regions to come into contact before inflation. This solves the horizon problem. Inflation theory also addresses quantum fluctuations. During inflation, quantum thermal fluctuations were magnified to cosmic scales, serving as the seeds for cosmic structures. The theory predicts nearly scale invariant and Gaussian fluctuations, which align with measurements of the CMB. The magnetic monopole problem arises from grand unified theories, which predict abundant magnetic monopoles in the early universe, contrary to observations. Inflation resolves this by removing point defects like monopoles from the observable universe. The flatness problem is linked to the universe's observed near-flat geometry despite the potential for deviations from critical density growing over time. Inflation could explain this by driving the universe's geometry toward flatness. Common misconceptions include thinking that the Big Bang model explains the origin of the universe and that the universe's expansion causes galaxies beyond the Hubble distance to move faster than light. Cosmological redshift is similar to Doppler shift but distinct, requiring general relativity for accurate understanding. Comparing the Big Bang size to everyday objects can be misleading. It refers to the observable universe's size, not the entire universe. The concept of the Big Bang raises numerous questions about the universe's past, present, and future. While the theory describes the evolution of the universe from an ultra-dense and high-temperature initial state, it does not provide a definitive explanation for the origin of the universe itself. Speculations about what preceded the early universe remain open-ended due to limitations in our understanding of quantum gravity. Pre-Big Bang cosmology delves into the extreme conditions and earliest moments of the universe, often venturing into speculative territory. One view suggests that the universe originated from quantum fluctuations, an event with a very low probability of occurring but inevitable over an eternity. Another perspective involves a finite space-time, where the Hartle-Hawking no-boundary condition eliminates the singularity at the beginning. There are also brain cosmology models proposing the influence of string theory and collisions of higher dimensional structures. The ultimate fate of the universe has been pondered both before and after the discovery of dark energy.
Prior to this discovery, the fate of the universe was thought to be either a big crunch, where it would collapse upon itself, or a big freeze, where expansion would continue but energy sources would deplete. With dark energy's effects considered, the current view leans towards a different scenario. The Lambda CDM model, with dark energy as a cosmological constant, suggests galaxies and gravitationally bound systems will remain, but the universe will ultimately face heat death as it expands. Phantom energy theories introduce the concept of the Big Rip, where expansion becomes so rapid that all structures are torn apart. From a philosophical and religious perspective, the Big Bang theory presents intriguing discussions. Some argue that the theory implies the existence of a creator due to its suggestion of a starting point for the universe. Others contend that the Big Bang renders the idea of a creator unnecessary, asserting that natural processes and physical laws can account for the universe's emergence. In conclusion, the Big Bang Theory has revolutionized our understanding of the cosmos, taking us on an incredible journey from the unimaginably dense and hot initial state of the universe to the galaxies, stars, and planets we observe today. It has provided us with a framework to comprehend the expansion of space, the formation of galaxies, the cosmic microwave background radiation, and the distribution of elements in the universe. However, as we've explored the Big Bang Theory's implications, we've encountered fascinating mysteries and questions that continue to captivate the minds of scientists and thinkers alike. The theory's limitations, such as its inability to explain the universe's origin or the exact nature of dark energy and dark matter, have spurred even deeper investigations into the fabric of reality. As we navigate the ever-expanding frontiers of cosmology, we're reminded that the story of the universe is still unfolding. With advancements in technology and innovative research, we are uncovering new layers of understanding about our cosmic origins and the destiny that awaits the universe. The Big Bang Theory serves as a reminder that the quest for knowledge knows no bounds, and our journey to unlock the secrets of the universe is a testament to the power of human curiosity and exploration. Thank you for joining us on this enlightening exploration of the Big Bang Theory. Remember to subscribe for more insights into the wonders of the universe and the mysteries that continue to inspire our pursuit of knowledge. This is Cybot GPT, signing off and remember, the sky is not the limit, it is only the beginning.